Back here in western New York today, a man convicted of attempted homicide for setting his ex-girlfriend on fire received the maximum sentence of 25 years in prison. Now, the victim, Jessica Cameron, spoke out after the sentencing today with some very powerful words for others who may be dealing with domestic violence. To your side's Jackie Roberts has that story. Having this conviction and this sentencing to me is poetic justice that he now has to serve those 25 years in retribution for the years he attempted to take away from me and our family. It was December 17th of 2018 when then 25 year old Jessica Cameron was set on fire by her ex-boyfriend Jonathan White. It happened outside of a Tim Hortons in Tonawanda. The attack that lasted for 78 seconds has changed her life forever. Now she's encouraging others in potentially dangerous relationships to have the courage to get out. Domestic violence advocate Amy Trabert is a high risk team coordinator and she says people who think they may be in a domestic violence situation should call the Haven House 24 hour hotline. Everyone's at a different point when they call. So some people are literally in crisis mode and some people are like, I'm thinking about leaving my situation. What should I do? And we safety plan with people over the phone as well. Amy tells us keeping victims protected after they come forward is a top priority. We work together with agencies, um, especially um, specific domestic violence agencies, law enforcement and other partners to make sure that we are keeping the victims safe and really holding the offender accountable at all points in time. People need to know that there are people out there that will help you, will be there for you, no matter how trapped or alone or scared you feel, there is someone to talk to. That Haven House 24-hour hotline number is 716-884-6000. And of course, there are several other agencies and organizations that work with victims locally, giving them access to things like counseling, shelter, and even guidance moving through the legal system. We'll have links to those resources on our website, WGRZ.com. Jackie Roberts, Channel 2 News.